This video is sponsored by Dollar Tree. Hi everyone, it's Anne here from Anne Makes. Welcome, thank you so much for stopping by. If you are new here, please remember to subscribe by clicking on the subscribe button below in the description box or on the Anne Makes on the corner of the screen. And don't forget to click on that bell so you can be notified whenever I post a new video. Today I have a DIY video, a Christmas crafting with Dollar Tree video. In this video, I will show you how I made this pretty, sparkly, very pink looking little tree that I will be using to decorate here in my studio. If you're interested in seeing how you too can make a similar tree in any color you want, stay tuned. There's a video coming right up. To make some trees like this, all you need are some styrofoam cones from Dollar Tree, some gemstones, which are optional, some acrylic paint, and push pins are really helpful as they are a great way to create a little stand for your styrofoam base while you are painting it. That's the next thing that we do is we paint the little cones or trees in uh, any color that we want using acrylic paint and I'm using a foam brush here. I find that that works really well for this. Uh, of course the next thing to do is just to let the paint dry so we can move on to the next step. Once the paint has thoroughly dried, uh, here's an option for you to use some glitter glue in the same color family as the paint and apply that very generously on top of the cone. Now something that you can do is apply several coats of this to have your little tree as sparkly as possible. Now, while this glitter glue is drying, I chose to add a layer of fine glitter. Everything I've used I got at Dollar Tree and you can too or perhaps uh, some of these items are also available online for my US viewers. So as you can see I apply a very generous amount of this extra fine glitter again in the pink. By the way I used less than a bottle for all three trees. Now the tricky part is applying these gems. Applying these gems directly to the glittered trees <laughs> didn't work very well the gems fell off. So I highly recommend that if you choose to add these sticky back gems, that you use an additional adhesive to really stick them onto your little trees. I also found that using these detailed scissors worked very well for cutting off these uh, little gems off each strip. Now I'm, I'm doing this with one hand uh, while the other hand's holding the camera. I just wanted to show you that sticking the gems directly onto the glitter uh, is not uh, very successful. <laughs> they uh, they just fall off way too easily so that's why I highly recommend that you use an adhesive, preferably one that comes out of a bottle with a pointy nozzle so you can apply just uh, exactly what you need. Finally to complete the tree I used hot glue 
over the edge of the candle holder and then I just place the decorated styrofoam cone on top. I hope you were inspired to go and make some of your own Christmas decorations following the videos in this series. To see more videos, just follow the information provided in the iCard or in the description below to uh, see other Christmas crafting with the Dollar Tree by yours truly. If you like this video, I would so appreciate a thumbs up, a like, a comment, and sharing is caring. Thank you so very much for watching. Until next time, stay crafty.